My name is Mike Perry. I have a company called African Reptiles and Venom. This company was incorporated in 1999 to supply snake venom for the anti-venom unit of South Africa. I uh, won the tender to supply the venom and in 1999 I started collecting lots of snakes to supply this venom. Because I live between Johannesburg and Pretoria, very soon many many people came to visit me to see what I do. Ask me all these snake related questions about catching snakes, keeping snakes, treating snake bites. And so much so that in the year 2000, I started doing snake related training courses. I do a snake ID snake bite treatment course where I teach people how to identify snakes, uh, what happens when a snake bites you, what's the first aid for snake bite treatment, the medical treatment of a snake bite, and also recognition and treatment of allergic reactions. The second course is called Venomous Snake Handling, where we teach people how to use various pieces of equipment, uh, what they'll expect from snakes when they approach them and how to apply the equipment and safely capture snakes. Uh, on top of that, I do a more advanced course where I teach people how to handle black mambas. So these courses are all done in one day. Once a month, I do training at my training center here on my snake training facility. These courses entail the uh, teaching of how to identify the snakes and then how to recognize snake bites and what to do for those snake bites and then the uh, courses with regards to handling teaches people how to approach snakes, how to safely handle them uh, so that when they leave here they are armed with a skill that they can use and they can safely capture snakes and put them back in the bush so they don't have to kill them. Who are these courses for? The people that will come to my training courses will be uh, corporates then they have problems with snakes, mostly remote mining sites, uh, alternative construction companies, once again, they uh, find lots of snakes there, and then those people need to come on the training. Uh, field guides come on training, and also then people that are enthusiastic about snakes, they also come and do the training courses. A lot of these people want to become part of uh, catch and release programs, and so they'll come and do the training so they can then get the necessary permits to allow them to do catch and release. African Reptiles and Venom has a, an affiliation with the Field Guides Association of Southern Africa. Uh, we've had that affiliation since about 2002. I was the first person to register my snake ID snake bite treatment course with the Health Professional Council of South Africa medical personnel can earn five CPD points when they do this training. I have an affinity for black mambas. Uh, I think they are very um, misunderstood snakes. And for that reason, I've made it almost a life study to approach these snakes, handle them safely, etc. I will handle a black mamba with a snake hook. Many people think that it's too risky that you must handle the snake with a snake tongue. But if you know what you're doing, you can handle it safely with a snake hook as well. Mambas do not attack you, just like any other snake, they just want to be left alone and do their own thing. And so, once you understand that, it becomes very easy really to handle them. They are highly dangerous though, you must avoid getting bitten by those snakes. A bite, if you're in the bush, is almost like a uh, gunshot, it's going to be fatal if you don't get your medical help. I've been handling venomous snakes since 1965, so it's now 53 years that I've been handling venomous snakes. Uh, we are also available through Facebook, so if you just Google African Reptiles and Venom, you'll find us on Facebook, and uh, we can communicate through Facebook as well.